because of the brave. Kind of a reminder of all the people who have sacrificed their lives for their country. A time to remember the true meaning of Memorial Day. So what do you guys think of the ceremony? For the Donahue family, <laughs> that means spending the morning at the Arkansas State Veteran Cemetery. My dad is uh, currently a colonel in the Air Force, and then my mom served as a uh, military police on the Air Force base. Antonio Donahue is a senior at Jacksonville High School, the oldest of six in a family that has lived all over the world. Our dad is deployed a lot. Uh, so that's difficult having him in and out. It's kind of a reminder like what would happen if something were to happen to him. That's why for young Antonio it's so important to stand with hundreds of others sharing similar stories. We are not only saying thank you with our mouths and our words, we are demonstrating our honor and respect. Lieutenant Governor Tim Griffin, a 22-year veteran, told the crowd of the importance of families passing on the tradition of Memorial Day. We can't assume that this sort of ceremony will just happen automatically. A sentiment clearly reflected in a crowd of families, young and old, and the Donahues, a different kind of brothers and sisters in arms. Politics does get interesting, certainly at times. At the end of the day, we're all part of the same country, same family. The military has been a big part of our lives, so it's going to continue to be a big part of our lives, whether we're serving or not.